Fight for what's right Fight for your life Stephen, thank you for sitting down with me. You have no idea how many politicians and reporters have been waiting for an opportunity just like this. Comrade, I appreciate the effort. As a war supporter, how do you react to all the criticism? The troops are idiots. I want to go on record with that. Would you ever travel to Baghdad to meet with the troops? The troops are stupid. How about San Francisco? Would you ever travel there to appear at a gay rights rally? Of course. I consider it my duty. I want to reach out to those guys and just show them the love. Now, if you had one message for America's orphans, what would it be? You little bastards deserve every bit of misery in your pathetic little lives. I hope you end up living on the streets, eating scraps from the garbage can. You should all be put in sacks and drowned. People are saying that your show is just a launching pad for your eventual presidential bid. Is there any truth to that? Yes. I love cock. I'm sorry, I got a little frog in my throat mm -hmm. there. But the people who are talking about me as president, all I have to say is... All right, is there anything else you want to say? Do you, say, have any hobbies? Passport. Shaved. Dwarf. 50-gallon drum of pancake batter. Lubricant, sour, salty, musky, kill all, milky, Dick Cheney, discharge, smack, devour, drunken McDonald's employee, every American's duty, rabbit sack. How has fame changed you? It is like a hunger, insatiable. Well, Stephen, thank you so much for sitting down with me. It was my pleasure. It was my pleasure.